Day Picks Alchemy. If you're not subscribed, remember to hit subscribe. We have a game going on February the 17th in which you will have the opportunity to win a Hinderer Viper Storm. It's uh, not a USA made Hinderer, hinderer. it's an Italian made Hinderer, but it's the only production Hinderer that I know of that has a horse on the blade. Doesn't mean anything, kind of cool to me, uh, but you never saw a ZT with a horse on the blade, I don't think, not even the 392. Uh, regardless, that doesn't matter. Um, see the stickers at the bottom of the board. Uh, any any kind of contribution to the channel? If you want to loan us some knives that we can do a uh, review on, uh, we'll pay shipping. If uh, you get stickers, if you would like to make a one-time contribution to the channel, you get stickers. If you'd like to join our Patreon, you definitely get stickers. Uh, I'd like to thank our Patreon member Michael, and today we would also like to thank our channel contributor. A contributor. <laughs> contributor. <laughs> contributor. <laughs> Mr. Satu Dave, who has sent us uh, a couple of knives to review. Um, one of those knives is this knife. It's still got a hair on it from when I was I was popping hairs with it earlier. <laughs> Excellent. Um, <laughs> this knife, Andre de Villers. Right. ADV. I was like, is, ADV is the brand. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that last name right. De Villiers, I was like, I'm not, I want to say De Villiers, or maybe De Villiers, you know, it's, I know it has an R at the end, but. And of course, uh, the page I got pulled up, don't have it on there at all. That's okay, it's not a big deal, but this is a Tonto 2, I'm a, uh, I'm, uh, the, the Satu is mind-blowing, you know, that he sent us, and, and I'm, I'm a, like, especially grateful you know, I, I told him his trust with, you know, with me, with these, these two knives were like one of the coolest bro birthday gifts I've gotten in a long time. <laughs> and he was like, man, that ain't no big deal. And I was like, I want to hurt him. He said, do whatever you want to with them. Um, I don't think I could hurt him. You know, like, I think it's, I think it's really cool. But what's, what's really, really cool is this knife specifically Let's see if you can see this. Is this light on? Yeah. It just sucks. Do you say that word right there? This prototype? Show it up. You know what that means? Me? Yeah. Oh, it means it was one of the first ones made. Yeah. It was like testing stages. That's right. Like that Catlin Bray guitar pedal I got? Yeah, like all the prototype cars we've looked at that never come out looking like it. That's right. <laughs> but this is a prototype Tonto, Tonto 2, the second generation Tonto by Andre de Villiers or de Villiers. I want to say de Villiers. It just sounds just right. Just because you, you like the way it rolls off. I, I kind of do. <laughs> and I also kind of like the way this thing fits in hand. This is this is almost perfect. And it's kind of hard to get it all on screen. So I'm going to lay it down for a second. Oh, go ahead. This was the one I was surprised, like, as big as it is. I will, of course, try to do it on camera. But, like, I can still one-hand it. Yeah. Easily. It's got excellent it's action. Me. Yes, it does. Especially to be so big. Yeah. You know, it's, uh, like, a lot of times bigger knives, they don't have that kind of action. And that's not what, what you really buy them for, is, like, impressive action and stuff like that. I am going to turn these around because mm. they're so... Sorry. No, no, no. That's okay. Uh, I mean, that's why we did the, 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 the Grayson. But they're so big. I'll put this one here. <laughs> Lord, have mercy. Just wait. It's going to see it. <laughs> yeah. Ha <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting it. Okay. Look at this. No room. So you can tell what kind of knives I normally have out here. <laughs> That's a PMT. And the big one. <laughs> this is another one of Mr. Satu Dave's. Knives in it is the Grayson. Grayman. 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 Yeah. Satu. Satu. But uh yeah. Both of these are some pretty good sized knives, but the obviously the Satu is bigger. <clears throat> And, and I personally would enjoy the uh, 
Tonto 2 better than the Saw 2 just because it's got the stuff that makes it functional for me. I'm not real good with the flippers. I think for an everyday carry, that, that I probably would too because I'm not used to carrying a, a, a knife the size of the Saw 2 yet. Yeah. Um, when, I, when I saw the Saw 2, I was like, Strider or who? You know, like, I mean, Str <laughs> Strider makes some big knives, man. Like, but the SNG, I think this thing's even got it beat by an inch. But, um, or the Satu does. Yeah. But the uh, the ADV, man, uh, it's supposed to be a, a South African made knife. Beautiful. It's It's got a, like, it's very intricate, intricate design. The frag, the frag pattern is so smooth. I put it in my jeans to see if it would, like, snag up and keep it from coming out of my pocket and it's it doesn't nothing man. like it's... the the big wire no nothing like the bed wetter at all <laughs> that one's got some rough frag on it oh you could you could sand a yeah, you could sand blast a car with the <laughs> the, the, the bed wetter. but um the action on this reminds me of uh, like a higher class riot knife you know, like it, it has that nice snap to it, and, uh, and it don't pop back out. Like it, it's no. Um, got great detent. And it's a heavy blade, man. But this one's an S thirty five VN. The overall length is nine inches. Yes. And close length is five inches. <clears throat> Which leaves you with a four inch blade. I, I screwed everything up with these. I'm gonna have to buy another one. Yep. Five inch with a four inch blade. S thirty five VN. Man, I was I was noticing that this thing is 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 really sharp. You know, it's I think I think it may be a little sharper than the Saw two. Yeah, you barely hear it. You can barely hear either one of them. Like his knives are way sharper than mine. I'm, <laughs> I'm proud of them. Oh, that's very satisfying. But we're gonna have to get one of those um, ASMR mics. I, like if I can refrain from talking, we can just record <laughs> paper cutting for eight hours. That way, knife lovers around the world can use go it to sleep. <laughs> to go to sleep. Man. Let me try. Surely I can cut with this thing. <laughs> I believe you can. You may. Can you get it in camera? No. Oh. Can you do it while it's in camera? Maybe not. <laughs> it's all good. It's hard to do it sideways. Yep, I just can't cut. That's okay. Like, it's it's really hard to cut sideways. Like, I, you know, I don't think I could do it like this either. Yeah, I mean, like, you know, really, you know, like, cutting away from you or oh, something. Oh, okay. Be, be a little easier. That's what you're talking about sideways. Gotcha. But it's all good. <laughs> I'm I'm impressed with this knife, and like it's like it, it really is an honor, you know, to be to be sent a knife that um that's a prototype. You know, like uh, these these knives are pretty cool. They're really expensive, and this specific one is not one that was I don't suppose sold. You know, it may have been won in an auction. It may have been given as a gift. It could have been, it could have been a lot of things. You know, it could have been like a yeah. Usually, prototypes aren't right. General market. Not, 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 yeah, not generally. But I love the blade design. I love the blade finish. Love the handle. I just noticed these little <clears throat> spots right here, like little. They, they're yeah. a different color and got the little grooves in them. Yeah. The pocket clips, like, it kind of has that hinder thing going on. What are you talking about? I mean, like, okay. I'm not, like I said, uh, I'm not sure hinder invented right. that, but like, it's it's kind of cool to see that when when you do see it is like it's got a filler tab or that's not what it's called. Anyway, it fills the hole. Yeah, fills the hole. 
Maybe it is a filler tab. I don't know. But uh, regardless, um, you know, you can take this and put it over there. Right, left hand, tip up only. And it's frame lock, and it's, I mean, it's just, it's just a beautiful, it's a, to me, it's a piece of art, you know, it's, it's just, it's gorgeous. Like, I, I don't know, man, it's. If I had to carry something big enough to, like, defend a bear compared to what I normally would carry, that would definitely be the, the big knife I would want to carry. Like, I can use it. I can handle it. I'm going to tell you right now. I, I'm not fighting a bear with a knife. Don't, unless it's. <laughs> Unless it's a code still, oh, or something like that, you know. If it's if it's rated for a donkey, <laughs> then you might be able to kill it. <laughs> I'm just thinking my normal use. I don't know what I would use for this big, but if I was going hiking, I thought I might really Ooh. need something. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean it, it was a it, it it would be a it would be an excellent choice for a, a carry. I can't do the reverse flick on this one very well but man thank you mr satu dave i'll go check his channel out i, I know he i know he loves it whenever i tell people that <laughs> now, listen it's not that he don't want you there he just likes to keep his channel small enough to where he can communicate with people like you know and, and i understand that he likes to talk to the people that subscribe to him because he likes to be surrounded by people who like the same stuff that he does and so like he don't like a lot of like i think what he's really trying to do is just like keep a small net community at least keep a null and void accounts from subscribing. Yeah. You know, like people are just coming over there and subscribe and they never contribute to conversations and watch the videos, stuff like that. So, I mean, I, that's, that's what I, that's what I take out of it. So it's not that he don't want you over there. He would love to have you over there. If you, if, if you're into the same things he's into and you want to, you want to talk to him about it, he would love to have you over there, but uh, don't just subscribe to him just to subscribe to him uh, as a favor to anybody. Uh, he would rather you want to be over there organically. And I understand that. But Satu Dave is one of the coolest people in the community. And I, I love him. <laughs> <laughs> but, Dave, I'm sending them to you. Please do. <laughs> You're keeping the kids. No, yeah. you take those two. No, you're keeping the kids. <laughs> We'll ride Harleys and carry bruisers. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Y'all have a good one. Catch you on the flip side.